Uh, good morning, Bavana. Good morning, Mary. Nice to be here. Happy to have you here and thank you again uh, to Australia, to you as well, for uh, appointing me as a champion for gender equality at UPU. What is your reflection uh, 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 regarding this breakfast we had today in this building? Yeah, thank you, Marin. I think it's really important that we um, get our colleagues together in the UPU so that we can ensure we move forward in terms of this very important work. As you know, it's part of the SDG, so we do have a mandate here. The UPU Congress last year also mandated us to have a look at this very important topic. So today's breakfast was really an opportunity to get everyone together and just make sure that we can continue on with this very important work on gender equality and empowerment of women in the UPU and within our postal organisations. What would be a main recommendation from Australia uh, towards UPU as a United Nations uh, agency to do more in this uh, uh, aspect? Yeah, it's a very good question. I think for me it's just supporting our women as much as possible. So are there opportunities where we can provide development opportunities, we can help support their growth, as well as supporting women as they as they go through and have families, ensuring that they can come back into our workforce and, and still move through the organisation at some of the more, more uh, senior levels. You being a woman, actually a very important uh, member of uh, Australian delegation, I remember you from many years from now. Is it difficult uh, being a woman uh, and having responsible positions like that? Look, I see, it as, um, I see it as a challenge, but it's one that I really enjoy. So I'm very lucky that Australia Post uh, supports women. We're um, very pro in terms of our, our gender balance. We have a 50-50 gender balance at, at the senior executive level. And there's a lot of programs that we have within Australia Post that help support my development, my team's development, and the development of women and senior leaders. So I'm very lucky to be part of the organisation. Um, as well, in Australia as a whole, we're very supportive of gender equality. So. Um, for me, although being in a senior role as a woman is challenging, I, I see it as something I, I'm very excited about and I look forward to the generations ahead of us um, being supportive in senior leadership positions as, as females. In case we would come with a proposal of, uh, let's say, increasing empowerment of women within this organisation, would be uh, happy to support it? We would be very, very happy to support that. We are, we are very pro at gender equality and the empowerment of women and would be very happy to help with any initiatives possible. Australia Post has a number of programs in terms of assisting our women uh, develop, particularly in an industry that is generally male dominated. <coughs> so anything we can do outside of our own organisation, we're always very happy to assist. It is actually, unfortunately, male dominated. I've seen yesterday during the Innovation Forum. But again, uh, you have our promise from the executive management side that we will do our best to change this picture. Thank you very much, Bavana, and really happy to have you here. Thank you very much, Marion. I'm very happy to hear that.